All right, everyone, back to your seats. Second half underway, and action is on Nick Cassavetes with 6-8 offsuit. Let's it go. It'd have been the old. Do you think I could represent? <laughs> <laughs> Barry means that in a hip hop sense. Represent. <laughs> Vanessa with Queen 9 offsuit. This is well within Vanessa's unopened cutoff raising range. And she does raise it to 1,300. Nine six of hearts for Antonio. Poker's kind of cool in that way. You can tell someone that your entire thinking and then go ahead and raise and bluff, and it's still hard for them to call. Jamie Gold started that. Yeah. It worked for him for five days. Or yeah, yeah, yeah. Or I, don't think days. It, I don't think it worked after that. Once no, they no, saw no. That. Antonio calls. If he could just flip the script sometimes and go off, you know, then it might work for him. He can't do it. It's amazing. Jack Trey for Friedman. Prahlad must be a little distracted by this conversation if he's thinking of playing this hand. And he folds. And Huggins is out. I think if it was no limit pre-flop, I might just put in some big re-raises. This, this pot limit holds me back a little bit. Yeah, that's the point. Heads up to the flop, 6 10 four, two diamonds. Antonio with middle pair. Middle pair and the best hand. Vanessa with the lead. Bet's 2,300. Antonio probably can't fold a pair to just one bet. Makes the call. Vanessa also could have been semi-bluffing some backdoor draws. Turn. Three of diamonds. Selps picks up flush outs. <laughs> Vanessa just picked up a lot more outs, though a nine high flush draw isn't so hot. She checks it. Vanessa may be giving up with that check. Antonio can't be in love with the diamond. Bets out 5,200. Antonio's looking to protect. There aren't a lot of good cards that can hit for him. Looks like I may have prematurely called for self-surrender. Perhaps she has sensed that Antonio is weak and can maybe blow him off his hand. Here come the 5K chips. It appears that Vanessa left her white flag backstage, Joe. <laughs> she is raised to 21,400. This is a pretty insane bluff with only queen high, but if you look at Antonio's hand, this could work. Betting the flop and then check raising the turn with error is affectionately known sometimes as the stack a donk play. It's actually a little outdated, but it looks very strong. Antonio's probably wondering to himself how often Vanessa would do this with an actual hand, though. Antonio does not believe he makes the call. A tough call, but a good one. Gulp. The river. Deuce of spades. Now that might look like a brick, but Vanessa could have been semi-bluffing a five on the turn just as easily as she semi-bluffed her diamonds. She's met adequate resistance from Antonio the whole way, so I'm fairly certain she knows she can't win this pot by checking. So the question is surrender or fire one last bullet. She's loading up. And Vanessa fires 59,700 on a stone bluff. There it is, the over bet. We've been here before. This bet is supposed to polarize Vanessa's hand. Nuts are air, and Antonio can pretty much only beat air. This would be an absolutely sick call. Vanessa could very easily have played a huge hand the same way. 59-7. 59-7. By overbetting, she's given him really tough odds to make the call, not even getting two to one. Is a pair of sixes gonna win enough to justify those odds? Not likely. Antonio with 119,000 behind. He's probably still thinking about that check raise on the turn. If she had a big hand, would she really have given him the chance to check behind? Finally, and people discount this more than they should, Vanessa has the stupidity factor in her favor. If Antonio calls and he's wrong, he feels stupid. I think, I think uh, Antonio turned her straight with like a pot of seven suited. Yeah. And, what is she and then have? I think she has a flush. I think she has it. Worst read ever. Well, that's what Prahlad the couch cannon thinks, but it's Antonio's read that counts here. And Antonio Folt, what is going on? Antonio Folt's. Little bit dirty on the pump fake by Antonio, but Vanessa, wow, what a sick bluff. Nice hand. Thank you. 